Thursday, April 27, 2023. It will gonna be an update. I'm gonna finish with the valve body, actually. Uh, what's happening? I supposed to receive the clutches yesterday at 6 p.m. Okay, I receive it today at uh, 12:30 a.m. a.m. 30 minutes after 12 o'clock at noon. Okay. So and I receive it incomplete. They're missing clutches from here inside what you see. They're not all the clutches. I'm still waiting the clutches. They are missing six clutches to be exact. That's the fluid. What I'm using, like any other time. Now, the solenoids with the new O-rings. Okay. The screen. The two caps. Somebody mentioned on a comment that they stopped making these covers on 2005, something like that. To be honest, I don't know. I have seen that the transmissions that nobody opened before, they are existing. And the transmissions that somebody opened before, that you can see signs, they are missing. It might be... I don't know, it is what it is. In any case, wearing gloves. And let's dress the valve body to wrap it again with nylon. To finalize it. The old parts, once again, they're there outside. This box over there is from this box. It's for the contactor plate. That's the old one. And that's the new one. All right. Keep it there for now. Wearing gloves, let me dress it. And before I wrap it, to see that again. It's a small update until I receive the clutches. Now, the clutches are 12.30, 3 three hours instead of the fluid. It'll gonna stay till tomorrow, probably. I don't know, I hope that I'll gonna receive the rest of the clutches today. But also the rest of the clutches, I need to sink it inside of the fluid for at least an hour. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> and you have to take it, you have to open the cover, you have to separate the clutches to don't be stuck together and then you have to place it back again inside to get soaked very well. Let's finish with the valve body, yeah. What did I said? To finish with the valve body, right? Oh, Tassos. Yeah, think twice. Like I said yesterday, I haven't torn down this plate here because I haven't changed the sleeve. That's why I have the X. <laughs> And I haven't torqued down also this one, and I haven't torqued down also this one. Where is it? There. This plate. So, nope. I did finish with the valve body. Unfortunately, <laughs> I have to wait for also for the sleeves. Lovely. Once again, wrapping it. Keep it in nylon until it comes the time, until they arrive the, the sleeves, okay? Now, now that I remember it, uh, regarding the oil pump, what they told me, they said to me, the owner, it's, he's leaving it to you, the, uh, the, um, the story with the pump. The pump, like I said before, as a pump, there's no problem at all. There's nothing wrong with the pump. It's perfect fine. It's, it's it's gonna run excellent, it's not gonna fail, it's not gonna have any problem whatsoever. What I'm saying for the pump, the one that doesn't have the needle bearing, I'm saying if you start your engine once every couple of months, one every once every two, three months, and you repeat that for one, two years, it'll gonna destroy the boost here inside because all the fluid is draining down and when it's starting at the beginning it start has much more wear because it's running not completely dry but it has a lack of lubrication I have shown you that I have a video from the same uh, problem previous video the 72.6 and you minimize the friction you don't have a parasitic losses if you like when you put an needle bearing I'm talking about it's a, this kind of bearing okay but it's here inside of the pump instead of being on the bush now, if the owner, he's starting the car well, at least once every week to have a fluid, to have lubrication, and he's not leaving it off the engine to drain all the oil down 
for a couple of months and then starting it again and it's dry, it's not good for the engine, it's not good for the transmission, it's not good for nothing, actually, then you're not going to have any problem. As an example, if, it's a, if you're driving the car daily, there is no problem, there is no need to change the pump. I mean, if there was any problem, if there was some scoring, yeah, then and you're saying that, you know what, okay, it's a good chance, let us say, now to change the pump, since it has a little bit scoring, has a little bit of wear, if you measure it here with the filler cage, you're going to put the update one, you're going to put the needle bearing one, you're not going to put the same type, all right? But in this case, that's fine. If the owner is starting the car at least once every week, you're going to have plenty of life. This pump, you're not going to have any problem, okay? I have mentioned that before, it's not the first time. Fine. So this will gonna be a small update. A small update that I just put the contactor plate, the solenoids, the screen inside, and the covers. Okay. I'll put them back in place. And I'll gonna cover it again with nylon because I have to open it again. But even though, even if it was ready, I don't have the rest parts ready. Hmm? Right? Yay! Lovely. When it comes the time, I'll gonna make another video. I hope that I'm going to receive today the classes. They told me that I'm going to receive the remaining classes today. The thing is, yesterday they told me that I'm going to receive the classes yesterday, and I received today. You see where is the problem? Where is the conflict? Never mind. Never mind. Same shit, different day, like I said. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.